As President Trump and his family celebrated Hanukkah at the White House, We wish you a very happy Hanukkah. Notably absent were congressional Democrats. Commenting on the snub, Representative Debbie Wasserman Schultz told McClatchy News, Why would you make partisan decisions about invitations that are entirely not partisan? Hanukkah is something that's important to all Jews. The tradition is to invite the Jewish members of Congress. In a statement, Representative Nita Lowy called the decision deeply unfortunate. According to Newsweek, there are 30 Jewish members of Congress, only two of them are Republican, and they tell McClatchy News they received invites to the event. Celebrating the start of Hanukkah a whole five days early, the president was praised for making the controversial decision to move the U.S. Embassy to Jerusalem. For the first time since the founding of the State of Israel, an American president has courageously declared what we have always proclaimed which is that Jerusalem is the capital of Israel. Weighing in on the decision not to invite Democrats, Morton Klein, president of the Zionist Organization of America, told the New York Times, quote, The president did not invite people who have been hostile to him.